Good afternoon teachers, good afternoon students. Welcome to Canossa School English TV. Today I have two students with me in the TV studio, Brandon here and Jackie, both P5 students, and they are going to do something today that will help you get ready for Easter, something special. So what are you going to do today? Okay, Easter bunny. You'll make an Easter bunny? Yes. One that we can eat? No. Not an eating one. Are you going to make one out of paper? Yes. Okay, so we've each got a piece of paper in front of us and the students will tell us what we have to do with the paper. So what's the first thing we have to do, Brandon? Take a square piece of paper. Go down from corner to corner. Okay. Corner to corner. To make a triangle. Put the finger along the fold to make it flat. Keep one finger up here on the top of the triangle, that's a good idea, okay? And then what do we do? And then open the triangle and make another triangle using the other two corners. Use your fingers to make it flat. You keep your finger on the top one, don't you? That's very good. Okay, done that. Push the triangle down on the table and then make a fold from the bottom toward the top of the triangle. It should now look like a bird. So it looks about two centimeters. Yes, about two centimeters. It must be very even too, mustn't it? Yes. The same all the way. Okay. Then make a small fold. This time from the top of the triangle downwards. Up here. And we fold it back this way, okay? Not too big? Not too big. Is that okay? Yes. Right. Fold the sides across to the center so that they met in the middle. Meet in the middle, okay. We've got to meet in the middle. Can I put my finger down here in the middle? Yes. Okay, and then I'll lift this one up. Yes. That's a good idea. And down here, that's in the middle. Mm -hmm. I think I know what that's for. Mm -hmm. And I do the same on the other side? Yes. Okay, there we go. Very good. Okay, then open the sides again and use your glue stick to glue them back in place. Thank you very much. Press them firmly. Okay, so I put some glue down in the middle here. Yes. Is that right? Open that one and put some down here too? Yes. Okay. Now, I've got the glue there. It looks a bit messy, so what do I do now? Please. Do I have to press these ones onto here? Yes. Okay. So bend the back again. Press them down. I hope it's sick. Are yours sticking? Yes. Okay. Put of mine down. Very flat. Now, Turn your bunny over. Oh, is this a bunny? Really? Take a dark colored marker pen and mark it to eyes. Mark into eyes up here, I hope. In the middle. In the middle, somewhere in the middle, okay. Two so eyes. A triangle nose. A triangle nose, good. Six whiskers and a W mouth. Six whiskers. I didn't know bunnies had whiskers. I thought yeah. cats had whiskers. Oh, they do. Mm -hmm. Interesting. And anything below, else? Yes, below the mouth, you can draw to a large teeth.
Where should we write the message, Jackie? Happy Easter. Where should we write that? At the back. On the back of the button. Okay. Mum and Dad? Good. Now, so going to stand up, you think? I could stand up. Oh. It's the Well, all finished. Thank you very much, both of you, for showing us how to do that. I hope all the students can make an Easter bunny too, the same way as you have made them today. And then on our next English day, perhaps everyone can make an Easter bunny and bring along their Easter bunny to get their card stamped for the English day. As well, they might like to tell us how many Easter eggs are in the special Easter egg jar. So that's two things we can do next um, English day. Thank you very much for your help today. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye.